hey guys welcome back to my channel and to another video today i'm coming back to give you uh, my week three check-in for the month of may and i'm sorry about the music there's some people doing a car wash behind here so there's nothing i can do about that i've tried filming this video different times and something is going wrong all the time so i really have to get this video up for you guys today so i will just go ahead and film even though there's a little bit of noise from outside so i will start with my transactions for this week and i have all my cash envelopes and i have all my flashcards and i'll just lay them out so that i can see the transactions i used to write down these transactions but i thought it's easier to just lay them down check for each each date and then proceed and just write everything down my most used envelopes are fair and grocery so we'll start with that so the the ninth was a the ninth was on no the tenth was on a sunday so i will start from the eleventh so the eleventh to the sixteenth i'll start with my fair i spent one two three four five one two three four five six six hundred shillings and that was transport and the category is from my fair envelope and then the same date on the 11th so that is for my food and it's from my groceries envelope and then the next one will be on the um, the 11th as well so on the 11th I spent 500 shillings and this was for my hair this is for my beauty envelope and then next is on the 12th and I have two photos so on the 12th I spent 3,000 shillings and that was towards Chama and the category is actually Chama as well then on the same day there's 400 shillings and this was for garbage and water and that was from garbage and water envelope Then lastly, the last transaction I had was on the 14th. And that was for, oh boy. This part here is supposed to be for birthday. So this is not for my hair, but for my birthday, my, my, uh, something I needed to buy towards, from that envelope towards someone. So on the 14th, actually, I spent 300 and that was for my hair and my beauty envelope. So I need to wait that out. Okay, so the 500 is actually from a different envelope. And that is birthdays and gifts. And description is gift so those are all the transactions that I had for this week so let's go ahead to our calendar we have already put down the stickers representing each transaction and let's fill that out so on the 11th on the 11th the 600 for transport and my fare is the green and the green sticker so transport is 600 shillings and then my food is 600 shillings as well then on the same day there is 500 for a gift and that i'll just write gift and then indicate the amount then on the 12th i had two bills to pay and that was 
the first one is chama and the second one is water and garbage so i'll go ahead and indicate that so the bill the first bill is chama the amount is three thousand next is water and garbage and the total came to 400 next is on the 14th and on the 14th i had a hair a hair appointment for 300 shillings so i'll just indicate the amount here 300 and i put down this sticker that says appointment and, and i think i have one more on the 16th then i think i still have another i haven't checked so let me just yeah on the 16th i do have another transaction and that is for 200 um the description is token and the category is electricity i feel like this month we are using so much electricity because i purchased um, some units on the 12th on the 12th mm, no on the 7th and then i purchased again on the 16th so i think the we're using a lot of electricity for this month which is fine because i've already budgeted for whatever we may need so on the 16th the bill is talking and the amount is for 200 shillings so with that done it's time now to do the actual check-in for the week so the first one is fair and according to our uh, calendar we have spent 600 shillings for that so 600 for fair the last time i did the check-in i had a balance of 1900 so 1900 minus 600 I'm supposed to have 1,300 in that envelope. That is what the flashcard says. So let's confirm with our envelope. One, one, two, three, thirteen hundred. So that account is fine. Close it. Next is groceries and groceries. According to our stick over here, we've spent 600 for this week, so we'll indicate 600. That's what my flashcard is saying. So let's confirm with the envelope. So 15, 30, 40, 50. So 15, 50 in that envelope. So I'm going to close that account. lastly is unbudgeted i do not have any unbudgeted figure uh, transaction so i'll just go ahead and finish up in my calendar so i've done for my food for my fare and um what else i think that's all i've done so let's do the first one which is gifts and this is the flashcard i did a uh, I did the, uh, the cash envelope stuffing on the second, so I put in 550. I had a balance of 950, and I have spent 500 this past week, so I'm supposed to have 450 in that envelope. So, checking the envelope, I do have 1, 2, 3, 4, 50, so that is fine. Next will be my bills, so I'll just check that. My bills, my first bill is Chama, and according to our last check in, I had paid 2000 shillings towards my first Chama, and now on the 12th, I paid the balance of 3000, so I'm not supposed to have anything in that envelope, and that is the case here. I do not have anything in that envelope. Next is water and garbage, and for this one, the last time we did the check in was. Um, the seventh, the last time I touched this money was on the seventh, and so I spent 400 shillings then, which is indicated here, and I had a balance of 800. And so for this week, I have two transactions from that envelope so 800 minus the 400 here 
minus the 200 so I'm supposed to have 200 shillings in that envelope that is the case I have 200 shillings in that envelope so it's fine I'll go ahead and close that account and check both tabs the both bills for the different dates for the 12th and the 16th so I'll just check that and also I'll check that and the last one is my hair appointment on the 14th I did my cash envelope stuffing on the second put in 500 shillings and 500 minus the 300 that I spent this week I'm supposed to have 200 shillings in that envelope and that is what my flashcard is saying and that is what I have in that envelope so that account is fine I can just close that up and check that this week I had one no spend day which is on Sunday and mostly that is what I usually have if you check my previous calendars normally on Sundays is the days that I actually don't have any spending and I have designed it that way because that is how I like it March calendar the same thing happened on Sundays so this is something that I have been doing but I might be able to have no spend days in between for example on 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 the 10th of April I did not have any spend day because I believe this day was a holiday if I'm not wrong we did not end up going anywhere or spending any money so for this week on Sunday I had a no spend and I'm very happy about that so so far for the past three weeks I have had three no spend days on Sundays with that said I think that is all I had for you today thank you so much for taking the time to view my videos and for liking and for commenting and also for sending me messages here and there letting me know that I'm doing a good job because it's really encouraging when you do that now my stickers are still um, available for you in my shop I will leave a link to my shop in uh, the description below if you're interested in this vid in these um, stickers and more because I'm not actually using all of them um, I will be doing a release video soon so that you can go ahead and see the new stickers that I'll be adding and some of some of which are already on my shop so you can just go ahead and check them out thank you so much for your time and for keeping me company if you did like this video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and click the little bell icon you'll be notified every single time I do post new videos which I have spread them out throughout the, um, the calendar so let me know if this is something you like, let me know in the comment section below. And I will see you very soon in my next one. Bye, guys.